Open up, Kalissa. The city watches everywhere out there. But I don't yeah, really no care shit. if they find me anymore. I saw Samuel in the river earlier. I'm sure he'll take you to Emily. One last trip, I expect. Oh, excuse me. Uh, that's from Samuel. Emily's tower key. Um, Sapiro. It's refreshing to converse with someone on my own level. I couldn't agree more. Your expulsion from the academy is a crime against natural philosophy itself, which you might have pointed out at the time. But it's pointless to hold a grudge. Yo, what up, boys? Good to see that you still breathe. The city would not be the same if you were not with us. I've completed Piero's work on an arc pylon, but only just. Nice. With this device, we can send a powerful electrical signal through the nervous system, merely rendering nice. our enemies unconscious, or they can be reduced to ashes. I've attuned it nice. so that we will be safe from the functions of the device will only trigger in the presence of our enemies. This arc pylon is more powerful than the older design. It will function at a greater range, striking down our foes while ignoring us. I need my nice. final sequence, which is recorded in the blueprint for this device. Havelock was inspecting it before the killing started. Return the blueprint to me. It was in his bedroom before he left. Hopefully, it's still there. You may navigate okay. the fields of battle with ease, but Sokolov and I are not as gifted in the same way. <laughs> Without the yeah, pylon, it is I got this. a matter of time before they put an end to us. We can get no worries, guys. No worries. Or you can go out and remove our enemies one by one, whichever you think is best. Okay, so we are going to Havelock's bedroom. See. Probably should not be coming this way. Inside we go. Ow. Wow, really? Did you just die? Fuck it. Miss me, bro. Alright. Once again, probably, uh... Should be playing this a little bit more cautious, but um, if I die, like I said, if I die, I die. I'm not really that worried about it because then we can go back and try and do this a little bit better. And I don't know why I'm going that way. I should be going this way. So his bedroom is over here. Uh, there we go. So we have to get back to Piero. Hopefully we don't die. If I can find, let me try and find some food here real quick. Because if I can get healed, then, um, I feel a little bit better here. There's really nothing here. Like, 
absolutely nothing. Let's see, what if we go maybe down a level? Let's see what they got downstairs. Is that money? No. Sit down, bro. Is there anything else? God, really nothing else? Nothing at all, huh? Fantastic. Maybe I can buy some from Piero. Let's go ahead. Not too worried about running into enemies. We will sprint and sprint and sprint for days. Let's see if I got anything up here. Ooh. A dog? Maybe not. I don't know, maybe I'm going crazy. Who knows? Alright. Down we go. What's up, Piero? Here are the blueprints. Astonishing. Yeah, I know. That's how good I am. The arc pylon is complete. Now to activate it. With this device, we can send a powerful electrical signal through the nervous system, merely rendering our enemies unconscious. Or they can be reduced to ashes. Yeah, what you guys said that. Um, put them all to sleep. As you wish, Corvo, we will be far away before any of them regain their senses. Ah, oh, food! Food, food, food! All is ready, Corvo. All that remains is plugging in a whale oil tank to power it. Will you do the honors? I will indeed. Thank you, kind sirs. After I eat. Come near us. Anything else? More food? No? We good? Okay. <laughs> Need food. <laughs> Thank ya. Go ahead and fill this bad boy up. Thank ya. Wait. Where is this going? Oh. Guess up here? Here? Where the hell is the thing at? Okay, let's go ahead and hold off and wait for him to turn back around. Okay, so he's going back that way. And up we go. To here. Um. There we go. Nice. Damn. beyond my greatest expectations. It defies description. A device like this will ensure Dunwall's security for a century. Nice. 
Now, I call my good friend Samuel. Now that you've eliminated the City Watch, I can find my way out of here. But there's no way I can help Emily the way you can. Yes. I'm sure it'll take you where you need to go. One last trip, I expect. Yep. Here comes my boy. Samuel! Good friend! Where the hell are you going? Down there, I guess. Thought I'd find you here. It never pays to bet against you, does it? I saw this. Yeah, signal. you know. <laughs> back, Corvo. I knew it. We'll need to get out. Thanks of for not killing me, bro. The admiral controls the military now. Martin's high overseer, and Pendleton's in favor with the aristocracy and parliament. They need Emily, of course, but if Havelock senses that it's all about to fall down around him, who knows what he's liable to do? Oh, he ain't gonna touch Emily. But I will. <laughs> that's one more trip across. I put a beat down on some people. That's where the Lord Regent was building his new lighthouse. Ought to be something to see. Let's go. All right, and once again, I'm just gonna keep on playing because I am. Enjoying this beyond belief. This is it, sir. I suspect Havelock Martin and Lord Pendleton landed there a while ago and went into the lighthouse. Knowing them, they're not giving up without a fight. I remember hearing the Admiral and Martin talking about this place as where they'd hold up if they had to. Anybody going in has to breach the fort and the gatehouse, and there's only one way to the top. Yep. All I can say is that it's been a pleasure serving with you. Maybe after all this is settled, we'll see each other again. Yeah, we definitely will. We some bros, man. We some broskies. If anyone deserves it, you do. I sure hope so. Give my Emily. After she's on the throne, she won't have time for an old man like me. Yeah. you were sharp, Corvo. But somehow you managed to get through all this mess without losing sight of what really matters. For that, I respect you. The city's gonna pull itself up, I believe. Too many good people here to let it all turn to ashes. I'd best be going. Yep. The battlefield's no place for an old sailor like me. That time is long past. Good luck, my friend. Peace, man. See you, Corvo. Or what? What? Bye, me. <laughs> See you, Samuel. Have a good one, Broski. Let's go harbor side entrance. Here we go. See, can I squeeze under here? I can. <clears throat> Ryan to be up there. Uh, so, oh, you don't see me. Ah. Peekaboo. <laughs> gotcha. See, let's put him right there. Let's see, who else do we have here? Shit. <sighs> All right, I think we're good. Why don't I just do dark vision? Okay, so we got one guy. Huh? 
Oh, you don't see anything, bro. So we have two guys. Oh, we got one of these assholes. I think you'll get your own squad after what happened last night? Indeed, I believe so. <clears throat> Come on, come on. Okay. Let's go down here. And I will just gently lay you down right there. Go up. Ah, there's more. What the hell? on shenanigans here let me go Let's see he's still looking this way Should we gather for whiskey and cigars tonight yes of course I don't know where the hell I'm going to. I mean, I, I know I'm going right there, obviously, but... 